Hey everybody, Destin Legary here at PAX South. You guys wanted to see more about Live Lock, so we're checking it out. Why don't you tell us a little bit about this game? All right, Live Lock is a post-human, fast action, top-down shooter. Uh, features three different classes of characters with insane firepower and a whole bunch of abilities. Yeah, so we just actually played it. There's a lot going on. You can kind of teleport around. Why don't you tell us a little bit more about the powers and options available to the player? Yeah, cool. So each class has uh, five different, um, what we're calling functions. Uh, the functions are a combination of defensive abilities, offensive abilities, and you have an ultimate. Uh, you can use them to get in and out of trouble or just to wreak havoc. Depends on your class, obviously, but uh, we're going with uh, three different classes that have different uh, pros and cons to them. Yeah. And you can uh, kind of customize a player, right? Yeah, so when you play um, destroy robots, you bust them up, grab some uh, carbon, metamaterial, reuse those, those, uh, those resources to upgrade your weapons, upgrade your character. Um, you can also find drops in the game that you, uh, you customize the look of your character, uh, make them really cool looking, shiny robot, or other, other kinds of stuff that you can do, yeah. So when you start out, do you have some of those options available right away? Uh, when you start out, you, you start out, it's been a long time. I mean, the game is set in a, about 150 years in the future, and uh, you're just waking up from your long slumber. So you're starting off pretty much with nothing, and then you got to build it up throughout the game. The character has kind of some fun attitude in the trailer. Is that just how he is throughout the game? Yeah, well, you know, it's a fast action game, and definitely that's the core fun factor for us. Uh, finding ways how to intelligently beat, beat enemies, uh, uh, outwit them, the AI is super smart. Um, but the character in himself has his own backstory. He's actually a human intellect that's been uploaded into this massive steel structure. Uh, and you uncover a little bit more about the character as you move on. As you move on. So, what were some of your inspirations? There's a lot of twin stick shooters out there, but you do a few different things. Yeah, you know, uh, we've been we've been told that uh, it's very like old school style game. Uh, I think it's 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 also new school because we're bringing a lot a lot more elements. Every enemy in the game has at least like two, three, four different ways that it can attack you, and uh, it's up to you to kind of find the best way for your strategy on how to beat them. So there's that added layer of of, uh, of um, tactics that I think that players are really going to like. We played a bridge level together. Uh, what were some of the other spots? Uh, other than the bridge or levels, yeah. So the the the, the game is uh, across three different acts, um, and we go all over the world uh, in these different places. We played that bridge, which was uh, it's a straight up assault uh, mission, re a real fun romp that you got the high score on earlier. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, so reminding everyone. <laughs> <laughs> and then uh, we're we're going into these frozen wastelands, more desertic areas, uh, uh, crumbled cities. It's uh, it's really cool. Um, where can people get this and when? So the game is coming out in 2016, and uh, we're going to be uh, making the game on uh, PC, Xbox One, and PlayStation 4. Cool. Well, thank you so much. Guys, what else do you want us to hear? Tweet at IGN Access with the hashtag IGN Packs, and we'll check it out for you. And for more on all things gaming, you're already in the right place. IGN.